What's up? What's up? What's up? You already know. This is Peach. And today I'm going to be showing you guys one of my favorite tax credit properties. A lot of people don't know about it. It's really nice, conveniently located. Let's go. All right, Peach Patch. So the name of the complex we're going to be looking at today is called Fairview Cove. It is by Concord. Concord, they have a lot of tax credit properties. Just so you know, tax credit properties is a type of low income housing similar to Section 8 and public housing because it is a type of government housing um, subsidy. However, you pay a certain dollar amount of rent and you don't have to have Section 8 and you don't have to be on public housing to get it. They do accept Section 8 vouchers though. However, normally they have a really long wait list because the rent is below market rate rent in the areas in the area it's normally a long wait list to get in and normally people that move in these also never move out to get into communities like fairview cove where you are in a tax credit community you do have to have income and you can't be over a certain income threshold depending on your household size it's normally only two people per room and what i love most about this complex peach patch is that they go from one bedrooms up to four bedrooms here in the front is the leasing office aka the welcome center so that's where you would go to submit an application you can also do an application online they do everything electronically actually they are three stories high and the buildings connect they have one bedroom one bath starting at 828 dollars a month which is a really good deal Ooh, over here peach patch you still will have to pay water and you still will have to pay lights water and lights isn't included also when you move into tax credit properties they have the right to change the amount of rent that you pay at any time so depending on the market so right now in tampa our real estate is extremely um, in high demand so rent is going up everywhere so when you move into tax credit even though the rent starts off at 828 if the demand for rent in the area goes up the government does allow them to increase the rent so your rent can go from 828 to 900 dollars, which is unfortunately which is unfortunate but they do give you notice that it's going up peach patch over here they also offer two bedrooms one bath and two bedrooms two baths for just 900 and $78 a month. We're going into the breezeway. They keep this property really, really clean. It is a small property. They do inspections to make sure you are cleaning your house like every month. That They do their inspections is sneaky. Instead of just coming to say, hey, we're doing an inspection, they actually come and bring you a new AC filter, which allows them into your home and they can take a little quick look around and see if you're keeping your home up to standard. That's how they are able to keep this community really, really nice. And it's been here for some years. Peach Patch, it's not that many buildings over here. Like that's one building. This is another building. I think it's like six buildings. One, two, three, four. It's six buildings, five or six buildings total. They have this little lake and then they have a pool. A Peach Patch, at the moment, there are three bedrooms, two baths are currently renting for $1,116, which seems like it's high, but honestly, y'all, in Tampa, three-bedroom apartments are going for anywhere between $1,800 and $2,500. So it's still a really good discount, $1,116. Comment down below if you think that's a good deal. Each patch here is a better view of the pool. Nobody is currently in it. It's so quiet, y'all. I am here on a... Tuesday afternoon, there's nobody outside, not even any kids. The pool is open for use and nobody is using it. That's one thing I do like about our tax credit housing and most of our public housing. They do come with pools. Like it looks like a regular apartment. You can move over here and people wouldn't even know that you're staying somewhere that is for people with lower income. Peach Patch, they also have this little area over here where you can come sit and eat your food. If you're at a pool with the kids or you just wanna get out of the house. I really, really love these apartments. They do have gas over here. These particular um, apartments, you cannot see a unit. Even if you apply and get approved, they will not let you see a unit until the day you move in and get your key. Now I know that sounds crazy as heck, right? But with tax credit properties, how they get away with that is because the demand for affordable housing is so high. People don't care about seeing the inside of the unit. They just want somewhere to live. I will tell y'all, these are 
beautiful inside they don't have stainless steel it's black um black appliances you'll have a black gas stove a black refrigerator you have washer and dryer in your unit they charge about fifty dollars extra on top of the rent for the washer and dryer to be in your unit but most of all of these come with the washer and dryer um what else do they have big walk-in closet um in the master you got a, a walk-in closet they're nicely sized and the thing i love most about this community is that they offer four bedrooms three baths you heard that right three baths can you imagine and it's a nice square footage for an apartment each patch with their four bedrooms three baths they are 1651 square feet that is pretty big for an apartment and they're only for $1,228 a month you'll get you a nice apartment I don't like that they don't have balconies that would be the only flaw on the second floor it looks like you have a balcony but that's your living room window it's not really a balcony that's the only thing I don't like about these but other than that I love everything else for a uh, uh, sign <laughs> assigned parking over here so you don't got to worry about fighting nobody for a parking spot they do charge extra so you get one parking spot that's included with your rent but any other parking spot that you want like if you have additional cars there is an additional monthly fee on top of it so i think it's like 15 dollars a month for each additional car but the good news is you won't have to worry about anybody filling your spot you can come home at any time of the day and know you're gonna have a parking spot it cuts out a lot of drama here's views of the other side like i said this community is really really small if they have an opening and you're looking for a tax credit property i would highly recommend these these are amongst my favorite even though they don't have a balcony and they're older they are very well kept very spacious and i love these they do an exceptional job with maintaining these like you'll be able to come outside and see the maintenance man every morning cleaning up any trash that may be out. They do a great job. Peach Patch, we're wa walking through this breezeway. I love to walk through breezeways of different complexes because then you can really see if they're dirty or not. And you see people aren't outside. The ground is pretty clean. Like I said, this is one of my favorite tax credit properties in Hillsborough County. Definitely amongst the best. Just like any other community, they do have, you know, a couple bad apples. But for the most part, it's so peaceful. Like, I have never heard of anybody getting shot. And here, you don't see people out here selling drugs. Like, it's very, very peaceful. This is a community you can send the kids outside to play. And you ain't really got to worry about nothing happening to them. So have a car center. So if you live over here, you can come over here and vacuum your car. Wash your car. And it's pretty cheap. I think the vacuum only, like, 50 cents. Let me see. Oh, it's a dollar. The vacuum is a dollar and the air is 50 cents. So pretty affordable. Can keep your car clean, your house clean, all that jazz. Comment down below, Peach Patch, what you're thinking about these so far. You can see, like I stated before, they have assigned parking. So all of the yellow is for your first car that comes with your unit. And then the red is for your second and third vehicles if you have multiple cars. And then they have white in the very back. Let's walk back there so I can show y'all better. That's for visitors. And then they have the white spaces, which is for visitors. The white is not a lot. And the ones that they do have, they're mostly all the way in the back of the complex. So when you're having guests, they might have to park all the way in the back and then come. But I love, 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 love this community. You are allowed to have pets, but you'll have to pay a pet deposit and I think pet rent. But you can not have dogs over here as well. Some people like don't like to live in apartments with big families. However, tax credit, it's okay if you got a big family to live in an apartment. Mostly everybody that lives over here has a family, especially that they offer, especially being that they offer four bedrooms, three baths. So you'll see a lot of big families. A four bedroom can fit eight people. You'll see a lot of big families living over here. Bedrooms are like on this floor. You see, that's the bedroom, bedroom, living room, bedroom, bedroom. That's how the four bedrooms look. As you look how well kept the grass is. I'm telling y'all, it's super clean and it's always like this. You go out over here at nighttime. Every now and again, you might find people outside at night, but for the most part, nobody's outside. Nobody's sitting on the stairs, smoking weed and stuff. Like it's very, very peaceful over here y'all these are my favorite kind of videos to do i love doing tours and i love informing you guys about different types of real estate i'm out of breath 
we big and pregnant out of breath but walking is good for us another thing i wanted to tell you guys is if you like this kind of community like wow that is pretty i would love to live somewhere like that i like the prices i like how they're keeping it up look in your area you don't have to move to florida to take advantage of tax credit properties they have these kind of properties all over america so you might be living down the street from a tax credit property and you don't know it's a tax credit property in citrus park a couple that i absolutely love i'll take y'all there another day and in west chase which is one of the higher income earning zip codes and on bayshore and people don't even though that is tax credit a lot of minorities black people don't even take advantage of those places because they don't know so you can move into those and these they're very diverse okay very 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 diverse and when you come over here the black people white people spanish people they're also conveniently located like literally two minutes up the street you have i4 and i275 so you have both of the interstates you can hop on go to the airport go to orlando based on where these are located right down the street from the casino as well i'm so out of breath and i gotta be i think it's only four buildings total four or five buildings total based on what i saw but see that all these cars home yeah it's so quiet you could actually hear the birds chirping let me shut up y'all hear them you can hear the birds chirping. They even got a sign say keep off the grass. They're gonna make sure they keep their grass nice and green. Those of you who are considering moving into tax credit properties like Fairview Cove, if you don't have a Section 8 voucher, um, you can still move over here. They do ask for bank statements, um, proof of income, social security numbers, birth certificates for all of the children, all of the minors who will be living in the house just to prove that they're yours and food stamps, um, proof of food stamps if you get them. Because it's tax credit, you can't be over a certain income limit. Now, the good thing about tax credit properties is each fetch. So we're gonna walk by the mailbox. I just wanna show y'all where that's at. But the good thing about moving somewhere that's tax credit, when you first move in for those first two years, you have to meet a certain income threshold to live there. But after those two years, you can make up to, God, I need to figure out the exact number. It's like $110,000 and you don't have to move. They also have a program within the tax credit community that will help you buy a house. So let's say you live over here, you like it, you've been saving your money, paying your rent on time, but you wanna own a home. You can actually go into the leasing center or welcome center and tell them, hey, I wanna buy a house. How can y'all help me? They actually have funds to help you with your down payment. So make sure you're taking advantage of that if you are living in tax credit. This is their mailbox center. So you can come here and get your mail. All of the mail is right here. It says mail kiosk. All of the mail is right here. Look, they ain't got nobody boxes getting broken into with screwdrivers. I'm telling y'all, it's very, very nice tax credit property. And then over here is the trash compactor. So you can put your garbage in there but like i said this community is extremely diverse i love the most about this also if you were to move into a neighborhood with not so good schools like i think the schools over here are they're not the best the area schools so if you don't want your kids to go to the schools in that area what you can do is take advantage of school choice that is something that hillsborough county allows where you can pick any other school to send your kids to and they can get chosen for the lottery or you can get your kids into a charter school in hillsborough county we have a ton of free charter schools that your kids will go to and they get free breakfast free lunch free tutoring all you have to do is buy their uniforms as i previously stated peach patch these are gated the fence does work the other fence is only open when the leasing office is open Hey, peach patch we are all done here i hope you guys enjoyed this really quick tour of this tax credit property fairview cove by concord rent they have multiple properties throughout throughout florida really but throughout the tampa bay area i'll show you guys more if you like this video you know what to do you know what to do go ahead and hit a like you like hey hit a like you like hit a like you like but your girl thanks for watching Just
see my videos You know your girl funny, yeah, you know your girl That's dope right. If you really like me, why wouldn't you hit it, yo? L to the IK, E-Y, babe Hit her like he like and send that love my way L to the IK, E-Y, babe Hit her like he like and send that love my way Light, 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 light Let's go! Light, 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 light Like, 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 like,